Hello, everyone. In this quick session, I'll be showing you how to add your email signature in Epic. So first, from your Epic home base, you're going to go to your navigation panel on the left and go to configure. Next, at the bottom of the navigation panel, you'll select user options. Then you'll select the distribution email account. Okay, the distribution email accounts page should pop up and your name should be selected. Next, go ahead and select your name and email address and click the pencil to edit. What you can do now is edit the email signature tab. And under the email signature, section, go ahead and click the plus sign to add. You can add a description to which email signature you are including here. So I'll just make it say Anissa default email. Please do check the default box. Okay, so in here you can type your new email signature or you can paste one that you've already had saved in a previous email. So you can, of course, do Control plus V to paste, or you can right click in the field, select edit, and paste. Now that I do have my signature added, I'm going to go ahead and click finish. So now I do see that an email signature has been added under my email distribution account. So once I am done, I'll click finish in the lower right hand corner. And I can close out of my configure window. And that's how you add your email signature in Epic. To double check and make sure that worked, I'll just go ahead and email one of my customers here. I have a contact via tab open under my activities list. So if I select my client's email address, an email should pop up from Epic, which it did. I'll just open up the window down here. All right, and there's my email signature that I just added. So again, that's how you add your email signature in Epic.